Hello, hello, what's up, y'all? Hey, this is your boy on Sunday. Where I'm around with this new video today. Uh, well, I plan to hope that this video reaches y'all the best of health and in the best of spirit. Uh, in this video today, I wanted to speak about uh, the Will Smith Chris Rock situation, which uh, took place at uh, the year Oscars 2022. You understand? Uh, I think you guys have already seen what unfolded, what has unfolded between uh, Will Smith and Chris Rock. You understand? I think Chris Rock was the host. You understand of the Oscars. You understand the person who is there speaking, and then invites the people who are to receive Oscars to come and receive their Oscars. You understand? So Chris was up there. You understand? As you guys know, Chris Rock is a comedian. You understand? One of my favorite comedians, of course. You understand? I like his stand-ups. You understand? I literally watch his every stand up. You understand? Because this man is fantastic. He just knows where to 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 to. <laughs> he just knows how to do his job. You understand? But that Oscars night, uh, uh, he went kind of a little bit, little bit too far. You understand? Uh, Chris Rock allowed himself to mock Will Smith's wife, uh, Jada Pinkett Smith, who is suffering a disease called the Poshia so whatsoever. Uh, a disease which causes her to lose hair you understand as you guys have seen her she's always she's always bald these days and uh, that's caused by a disease she's suffering a disease that causes hair less hair loss uh, in people so chris rock kind of joked about this hair loss or made fun of her you understand knowing well that jada pinkett smith is suffering a disease that's causing her to lose hair you understand you understand so when she mocked Jada Pinkett Smith, Will Smith himself also, and every other person uh, there in that hall were all having fun. They were all laughing. You understand, including Will Smith himself was also laughing. And I had also noticed Lupita Nyong uh, uh, sitting next to Will Smith. They were all having fun. You understand. But Will Smith's uh, mood changed uh, as soon as Will Smith saw his wife's face. Jada Pinkett Smith's reaction to the joke. You understand, which. Uh, which, which is demonstrated in her uh, facial expression that she, did, she really didn't appreciate uh, Chris Rock coming for her, uh, uh, for her boldness, you understand, which is caused by a disease. So as soon as Will Smith noticed that uh, uh, his wife really didn't, uh, didn't appreciate that joke of uh, uh, Chris Rock, Will Smith, as a man, he stood up and walked toward Chris Rock on the stage. You understand? I think Chris Rock didn't never expect to be slapped by Will Smith, you understand, because he always, everybody, not only Chris Rock, but everybody knows Chris, uh, Will Smith as also a, some form of comedian, a cool person, you understand, a person who who really uh, uh, is the definition of love, you understand, a person with a great sense of humor, with patience, you understand, with tolerance, you understand, so Chris Rock never expected a slap from uh, Will Smith. You understand, but suddenly Will Smith, Will Smith <laughs> went to stand, stand close to him. You understand, to the to 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 the point he knew that if he threw his hand, he will. <laughs> that he would never miss uh, Chris Rock. Then he went for it. Pa, you understand. He gave uh, Chris Rock a very dry slap. You understand. <laughs> and he went back and got his seat. You understand. So Chris Rock stayed like a... Huh? <laughs> Later on, Chris Rock, but Chris Rock handled it really with strength. You understand. He handled it with strength. He stayed calm. He stayed relaxed. Although there was some kind of change in his face. Because I think he was trying to get what he said. <laughs> It took him a while to understand that he really just got slapped. And really, it was by Will Smith he got slapped. You understand? And mo the moment he got slapped is a moment he never expected to get slapped. You understand? And the person who slapped him is a person he never thought would ever take such action of uh, slapping him on stage. You understand? So it took Chris, Chris, Chris Rock a little seconds, you understand, to kind of uh, put himself together. He, did, he still did not like uh, lose it. You understand he did not lose it but you could feel a sense of nervousness in his voice in his facial expression but he still maintained his composure you understand he never lost it you see i really give him a heart for that one chapeau like we say in french language chapeau you understand 
So after this took place or after this happened, Will Smith went to see, you understand? And Chris Rock said, <laughs> Oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. Uh, Will Smith has just slapped the, the hell out of me. You understand? And Will Smith replied saying, get the name of my wife out of your fucking mouth. Get the name of my wife out of your fucking mouth. Will Smith said this repeatedly. You could feel in the face of, uh, of, uh, of uh, Lupita Nyong'o who sat next to Will Smith, you could see she was really shocked. You understand? And was about to run away because she thought maybe Will Smith would get to her to <laughs> and give her her slap. You understand? So after all this happened, uh, you know, the world population, the people would always react. You understand? Each one trying to be the, the best judge. You understand? Each one trying to condemn or reason. You understand? Will Smith as, as much as they can. You understand? So, so after what the people just reacted as they would usually do. You understand? Uh, uh, some condemned Will Smith while some uh, really uh, stood with Will Smith. Some said he did the right thing in defending his wife or his loved ones. You understand? Some says he went too far. He could have handled it in a different way. You understand? Well, like I said, like like a saying goes, in this world, no matter what you do, people will always react. You understand? There some will react uh, in your favor, and some will react against you. You understand? So, like the saying goes, just do you, because no matter what you do people will always respond or react either positively or negatively you understand so afterwards will smith stood when he was called to receive his oscar you understand oscar which he won that night of course when he was called to receive it while on the stage he shed tears you understand and uh you know made some speech you understand his words makes a lot of sense because will smith is someone who who speaks from his heart you understand his words always come from the heart you see he said people ex expect them to always uh, accept everything. You understand? People expect them to always accept everything. Even you get insulted, you're supposed to make fake smiles. You're supposed to agree with it. You're supposed to pretend that all is okay when nothing is okay. You understand? So now let's get to what I think. The people who said what they had said, some opposed Will Smith, some uh, agreed with what he said. Now I will tell you what I believe. What I believe. You understand? Well, what I also the real believe is here. I believe that Will Smith, Will Smith did what he believed he should do. You understand? In order to be a man, a husband, in order to be a, a man, his wife can trust, his wife can count on in times of uh, 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 attacks, either verbal or physical abuses. You understand? That's what Will Smith did show his wife. And he did the right thing. You understand? Because he acted within his beliefs. You understand? And in, uh, in, uh, in some other way, I also believe that he could have handled it in a better way than uh, going on the stage uh, to sleep, to slap Chris Rock. You understand? I think he should have uh, maybe after they finish with all the show, with all the laughs, he should have called. If he has Chris Rock's number, which I believe he does have, you understand, call Chris Rock and chat with him, you understand, and tell him what he did, you understand, it's not right. You understand that his wife is suffering from a disease. You understand, a disease which causes him to, which causes her to lose her hair. You understand, and I don't think this is uh, the right joke to do uh, uh, to my wife. You understand. If, for example, my wife did it as a style, then uh, you as a comedian by profession, you understand, you could have, you could mock it. You understand, and you could understand it. Even my wife also would have uh, perceived your joke uh, uh, differently than she actually did, because she's suffering from a disease, and as a result of that disease, she's losing her hair. So it's not right to mock her. You understand? So that's what's up, guys. You guys, let me know now what you think. What you think of what I believe, or how I believe you should have handled the situation. You understand? And let me know what you guys also think he should have handled. The situation you understand if you think he did the right thing by slapping Chris Rock you understand or if you think uh, he should have handled it uh, in a different way and what also you think of the way Chris Rock handled the situation you let me know all of it 
in the comment space so like i always tell you guys after watching my videos or even before watching my videos always remember to to subscribe to my youtube channel always remember to to, to like my videos always remember to share my videos with your friends invite your friends to like my youtube channel or to subscribe to my youtube channel support your boy omson the wheel so that's what's up guys until next time see you again peace out